Prime Minister Narendra Modi has just inaugurated the India Pavilion at Hanover Fair and just to kind of assess how it all went, we have one of the prominent members of uh, industry, Sanjay Kirloskar. What did you make of India's pitch? Do you think we're going to succeed in getting business in now? Yeah, I think uh, Mr. Modi has been there for a year and a lot of things have moved in India. A lot of laws have been changed uh, to help Indian businesses prosper. And uh, the fact that uh, he goes around inviting people to come and invest in India, which is the India story, I think that's a wonderful thing for us. You know, everyone's been really, really positive about what the Prime Minister is doing. But we've heard a couple of voices from industry, mm -hmm. Mr. Respectable Voices, Mr. Deepak Patel, group chairperson, uh, saying that it's great, we have, uh, you know, the lots of promises, but things What's, where do you stand on that? Uh, overnight and uh, a lot of, uh, I, I'm aware that a lot of meetings have been held, subjects have been discussed and one by one, you know, you see things being done to make things easier to do business. I, uh, I'm aware that Mr. Modi is very keen that along with the center, the states also move ahead. And therefore, this uh, federal uh, cooperative federalism, I believe he called it. That's good for uh, business? I think that's good for business because states and the center, we are a federal country. And we need to make sure that our states are strong. Because once the states are strong, the country automatically will become strong. And I believe once Indian businesses are strong, the Indian economy will also become strong. I, I want to ask you that it's marking one year. Uh, is there any problem that you feel needs to be fixed by Prime Minister Modi? Uh, like? I, I don't know, sir. Your assessment. My assessment. Well, uh, over here, you know, the welcome has been uh, very good, uh, whether it was France or over here. But there is a slight concern that we do detect. Um, yes, just yesterday, there were some protests outside the uh, small, small group uh, saying protect India's minorities. And outside the uh, fair opening, uh, whatever the function they had yesterday, and uh, it was regarding protecting India. You know, we, we are a secular nation, and uh, we have to be, uh, we have always been a secular nation, we have been a tolerant nation, but these kind of things, uh, small incidents that might take place in Delhi or Mumbai, uh, they are now, you know, in this day, and the internet, yes. Everything goes across uh, very quickly, and especially if it's churches, then people might uh, get upset, right? And we have to understand that most of the investment that we want is from Christian countries, right? All oh, right. right. So okay. yeah. uh, I'm sure that the Prime Minister is uh, talking to his people to make sure that, I mean, this is not something... That nothing can be state-sponsored like you have in other countries. Yes. And we have to send the right make sure that this development story doesn't get uh, Did uh, people, did other members of the that to the Prime Minister? I know that, you know, you have, you've had meetings, interactions, did you tell the Prime Minister that, look, you know, how that, you know, things like that, how it affects business? Uh, you know, most of the discussions have been related to uh, what needs to be done in government. We've not had a chance to talk to the Prime Minister on this, but I'm sure he he understands what is going on, and I believe he's handling it in his own way. Thank you, Mr. Gurloskar. Important message going there. Thank you.